What is that, your script? I am supposed to pretend like I'm actually enjoying it. I'm joking, I'm joking. Did you know that the president of Nigeria and his vice president is here? They did their campaign here. Mm. Okay, let's check out all this hood. What's going on here? Is everything this, okay? Oh. Why'd they give us so much? This so this is, is the jollof rice? Yeah. I know some people say jollof, and some people say jollof. Do you need yeah. a spoon? Yes, I do. So we do spoon the rice. Some stuff we eat with our hands out. Yeah. Oh, it smells smoky. See how I eat it? I put a little bit of plantain and rice. I would for you to eat it, so I see if you die. I'm mm. joking, I'm joking. <laughs> Smoky and spicy, but it's got a very smoky flavor to it. Is that a plantain? Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of tomato, and then very spicy, and then just like a complex smokiness to it. I love that. Is it always smoky <laughs> like that? No, if they don't do it good, it's not smoky. So it has to be smoky. Did you know how this place got the name White House? No. The lady that owned it, she's late now. She got the place, a small place that it was in front of the White House. So when she's trying to explain to people how to get here, mm. She'd be like, okay, just come to the place by the White House. The White House was kind of old. And then when she moved to this place, she just kept on calling it White House. I've seen so many restaurants like that around the world. They don't officially exist. And if you don't exist, you don't have to pay taxes. I wish I didn't exist. What else are we here to try? The pounded yam. Yeah. And the yams here are like the size of a watermelon. Watermelons are small for yams. Like two watermelons. Three. Like three medium-sized watermelons. Yeah. We talked to the chef. He said there's no clumps. It's smooth. We pound it. We use our power, we use our energy to form everything out for people to know what we are doing is right. No shortcuts. Yeah. It's about hard work for good food. Of course. I use my hands? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I like that. I like the hand feel. I feel like I can taste it with my fingertips before so it even gets to my mouth hole. You're taking like a baseball sized fist. <laughs> Are you going to throw that at you someone? Know what? Some people oh, actually eat, eat this much and swallow it at once. And I'm there Wow. Alright, what do I do next? Roll it into a small baby ball. Okay. I like to make mine a nice clean circle because I'm perfectionist or because you can't fit it in my mouth that way. So we sop up this oil. Whatever juices are in here, we're gonna sop that up. Alright, let me try it. You need to take it with the soup, with the veggies. Whoa, that's cool. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Whoa, it's like chili oil, man. You need to get this. <coughs> the veggies. This one. Yeah. What's that? It's a soup. Why is this soup solid? It has vegetables in it. it Usually soup to me is a little more um, soupy. When I first went outside of Nigeria, I thought they would say soup and I would see like liquid. And I'm like, where's the actual soup? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm going to get whatever. That's fish. Ah, a little fishy. Let's try it out. <laughs> you got to watch that. Okay. Oh. If you I were like Nigerian, that. you would be from Yoruba because your hand is Messy. It is pretty bad. Wow. Look at this. Do you have a napkin under there or what? No. Uh, it's just you? It's just where I'm from. Aww. You eat like a baby, like me, me. Oh, sorry. I shouldn't do that on camera. Mmm. <laughs> That's really good. Also spicy. Yeah. Well seasoned. There's fish involved. Now, you're not actually from Lagos. Mm. What do you think is the personality of this city? Very active and very fast. Hey, everything is so fast here, literally. This would be like the New York of Nigeria. I feel like everyone comes here because everyone knows that this is where all the magic happens. So I would say it's pretty diverse. And I would say these people here are more open-minded. There's a different level of intensity in Lagos than I've seen anywhere else in the world. And one example is like the chef. You ask a question and he's like attacking it. We got to attend to you. We give you what you want. When you do what you want, you attend to us. Why are we here? We are here because of you. Like it's an audition for uh, cats or something. Maybe that's not a good example. Is that a similar type of passion you see with a lot of people here? I think it has something to do with communication. And he is also obviously very passionate about what he does. Like he clearly loves it. And he's also trying to tell you about his restaurant. Yeah. And I feel like that's the way he knows how to express himself to a foreigner and to obviously to welcome you here. And he's, he's he, like he said, you, you feel free to do whatever you want here. Boom. How skin? Pomo. This could have been one of your Chanel purses, but instead we're gonna eat it. Usually, like sometimes they cut it into smaller pieces and put it in your food, so there's like a little bit, teeny weeny pomo inside your food. I mean, it's super like gummy, mm -hmm. right? Also smoky. Everything is the color of heartburn <laughs> and anger. No, it's orange, the color of the sun and light. You know, in Korea they eat the skin too. They eat mm -hmm. pork skin in Korea. Would you ever try that? I'll try anything Korean. Quick hand check. I'm still clean now. I don't know. You have it everywhere. Let us know in the comments down below. It's only, it the guess what? It's hands. only the fingers that I, look. We're cleaner because we actually lick our fingers. Oh, you they do? They don't. Had you waited a little bit longer, but I lick my fingers and it's brown. Yeah, it's a little bit of dessert. 
right? Mm -hmm. Best ever food review show bandanas for you and your entire extended family. Now you can finally stop the sweat on hot days or important job interviews. You can cover up your receding hairline. You can pretend to be the karate kid. You can lead a summit on climate change. You can hide from your responsibilities. You could hide that embarrassing tattoo. Or you can look like the world's most lovable food review show host. Oh, wow. For each order, you will receive three bandanas in three different colors. Red, black, and white. This is a one-of-a-kind, unique design you will only find on our website. Visit our store and check out all of our merch at shopbesteverfood.com.